The Minister of Health Terence de Alsing is concerned that citizens are not taking the COVID-19 pandemic seriously or the measures adopted by government. Speaking during the virtual media briefing on Saturday, the minister cited noted international developments to try to get people to change their mindset. This comes as the positive count has risen from 109 to 112. A dozen persons in total have now been discharged from hospital. Ian Wason has more. While driving west on the highway to get to the media conference, Minister of Health Terence Dial Singh related that he observed persons being intercepted by the police. They were not abiding by the lockdown order. I saw them stop about 10 to 15 vehicles, mainly filled with young men in short pants, what looked to me like beach attire. And every trunk that was opened had coolers in them. So they were going to party somewhere. He also condemned the COVID-19 party that a team of officers led by Commissioner Griffith shut down in Wallerfield last evening. That one act of recklessness is what will cripple our healthcare system. Because it takes one person to be reckless to infect 10, and then 10 infect 100, and 100 infect 1,000. To drive home his point, the minister related that a foreign newspaper in Italy printed 13 pages of death announcements. He also stressed the need to stay at home, revealing an isolated Amazon tribe in Brazil reported one death. Dr. Avery Hines warned the citizens against dropping the ball. We cannot, under any circumstances, take the position that, well, we are young, I'm 20, I'm 30, I'm 40, and therefore... I am healthy and robust and will not be badly affected by a COVID-19 infection. Some people are unaware of comorbidities that they may already have at 20 or 30 or 40. There are persons who do not know that they are hypertensive or do not know that they are diabetic because they haven't yet been diagnosed. Dr. Hines confirmed the novel coronavirus or COVID-19 is a new virus and medical experts are still learning the behavior. Ian Wason, TTT News.